what's up it's me Kayla and welcome to my channel today I have a very fun video for you I'm going to be showing you guys what I got on my no budget target shopping spree where I could only buy fall and Halloween related items so I have lots of bags to go through guys like there are literally one two three four five six seven bags in front of me I actually went out and got all this stuff today and then I changed my shirt so I could film this haul for you and by the way this shirt is from Target. So yes, Target's practically my home away from home. I am there at least two to three times a week. So anyways, without further ado, we are just going to get right into this and I hope you guys will enjoy watching. So first we are going to be going through this bag because it's sitting right in front of me. So why not? I got these Halloween Oreos and they say boo on them. How cute are these? I simply could not pass them by. Okay, they look so good. It says five spooky Halloween designs. Ooh, now I'm intrigued. Then, more food of course. I got these caramel apple pops. And these are just something that you have to buy every single fall, no matter what, okay? They're just a must have. I love these. They actually taste like legit caramel apples in lollipop formation. I don't know who couldn't love these, so we got those. Then I got this pink sweater right here. It's like a very pale pink, but I can see me wearing this a lot because I wear this color quite often. And I think it's perfect for the current weather right now. Actually, it was literally 88 degrees outside where I live today. But after today, the weather's supposed to get a little bit more chilly. And this is a little bit warm, but not too warm. So it's perfect for that like beginning of fall type of weather. Okay, so there we go. I got two bags of candy. This bag right here is the Werther's Original Caramel Apple Chewy Candies. I cannot wait to eat these. I got these last year and I love them. And then I also got the pumpkin spice version. So I don't think I've ever tried the pumpkin spice ones before, but these are pretty much like soft caramels and um, yeah, like I said, I've tried this kind before and I'm very excited to try pumpkin spice. So there's that. So then guys, we have this bag to go through and I literally am obsessed with everything that's in here. Okay. First we have this super fun fall decoration. It's a pumpkin and it's black and white, like checkered, I guess. Um, it's really cute and this will really go well with the rest of my fall decorations that I currently have in my bedroom. If you guys would like to see a fall room tour, totally let me know because I will happily do that for you. Ooh, okay. I got three fall bath bombs and these were only $3 each and the scents sound bomb, okay? So this one is cranberry apple. Then we have ginger pear. And lastly, vanilla brown sugar. Ooh, I'm most excited to try vanilla brown sugar, but all of them sound really good, and I'm so excited that I got all three because I could try a different one every night. Then I got these lip glosses right here, and they have fall packaging, as you could see. Um, so it was only $3 for four lip glosses. I don't really think that these have any flavors. I mean, I'm not sure, but it doesn't say anywhere on the lip gloss itself or on the back, so I have no idea. They were fall related because look at the packaging. There's leaves on there, okay? Then I got this black bath bomb and I thought it was kind of Halloween related, you know, um, because it's black and it says it's a galaxy bomb. Ooh, guys, I just read it. It says it's a black amber bath fizzer with a surprise inside. Well, I can't wait to see what the surprise inside is. All right, then I got this nail polish right here and I can't wait to use it. It's like this orangish gold sparkly color and I already know exactly what I'm going to use this for okay well obviously I'm going to use it more than once but I know that what I want to do is okay so see this orange nail right here okay I'm going to put a coat of this nail polish on top of the orange fingernails because I think it'll add a little something something I got two fall candles and these were only $4.99 and let me tell you they smell incredible so this one is cinnamon apple cider because I have an obsession with apple cider. Oh my gosh. That smell just like makes me instantly happy. I love fall candles more than anything on this planet. And then we have this one right here. And I have to say that this is my favorite one. It's called Cinnamon Pumpkin Muffin. And that is, oh my gosh, it's so spot on. It's scary. Wow. Yeah. 
it's hard to believe how amazing these are so I got both of those then I got this pumpkin cheesecake Ben and Jerry's ice cream I could not pass this up guys it looks amazing I think I need to put it in the freezer though ASAP because it's definitely melted like I just shook it and listen Oh yeah. Today it was 88 degrees where I live. Crazy, right? Summer weather is just not ready to leave. Oh my gosh. So this next thing I thought was just too cool. It is a Haunted Mansion chocolate cookie kit. And pretty much it's like a haunted gingerbread house made out of chocolate. Okay, how fun is this? I am going to pick a night where I just sit down and do this. I think it'll be so much fun and... I think it comes with candy. It says includes black, orange, and green icing in decorative candies and sprinkles. So I think this was around $20. And I was just really intrigued by this. I've never seen anything quite like it. And I'm just so happy that it exists. In this bag, we have some comfy, cozy fall items. Yes, we do. All right. So first, I got this pair of socks. And I swear, I get a new pair of Halloween socks every year. Um, so it's kind of a tradition at this point. They are black and orange striped, as you can see. And these were only a dollar. Like, a dollar. They also had lots of other different prints and patterns to choose from. Um, so if you're looking for some inexpensive Halloween socks, hit up the dollar section at Target. Oh my gosh, I am so excited about this blanket, guys. It's this burnt orange color and... Oh my gosh, I just can't wait to put it on my bed. It'll totally make everything feel more fall-ish, and I just could not be happier about this purchase. Like, when I saw it sitting there, I'm like, I need this in my life. It was calling my name, so I got it. Next up, guys, let's see what's in here. Okay, so I got these caramel apple pie K-cups. I was gonna just go for pumpkin spice, but I already had a pumpkin spice frappuccino today. And, you know, I've never tried this kind before. It sounds interesting. I love caramel apple flavored things. So hopefully caramel apple pie coffee will be good. Um, I mean, how could it not be? Ooh, and then we have yet another fall food okay these are pumpkin pie pop tarts wow that's a really fun sentence to say pumpkin pie pop tarts i just love that alliteration okay so i actually snatched up the very last box that they had so i'm assuming they're pretty good if they are now sold out like i said i got the very last box so can't wait to pop one of these in the toaster and try it out all right, then I got a decoration right here that I typically wouldn't get. It is a skull. I thought it was really neat the way it was decorated. And they have skulls that are decorated this way in Epcot in Mexico. If you've ever gone to Disney World and gone to Mexico and you went on the ride, then you would know what I'm talking about. They have skulls that look just like this. So it kind of reminds me of Epcot. That's why I wanted it. And I just thought it was something different. So I'm going to put it in my bedroom and it was only $3. Not that that matters because this was no budget, but just worth noting. Then I got two packs of stickers because if you didn't know this already, I run my own lip balm business and when I ship out fall orders, I like to decorate the outside of the packages with fall stickers just because I think it adds a little something. I got this pack right here. It comes with 126 stickers and they're just so cute. I love the little skeleton guy. Ah, he's adorable. And then this has to be my favorite set of stickers ever, okay? They are little fall critters going trick-or-treating. They're all dressed up. You really can't see it that well because of my ring light, so I apologize. I cannot wait to decorate some lip zest packages with those. Then, guys, okay, so in this bag, ugh, it's so heavy, but there's literally just one item, and that is a jug of apple cider. I don't know about you, but I could not think of anything more amazing than sitting on the couch with a comfortable blanket, drinking a nice warm cup of apple cider. Oh, it's pure heaven, pure bliss. I actually like warm apple cider more than a warm pumpkin spice latte. Just saying. Okay guys, and now for the very last Target bag. I got the most comfortable sweater ever. Oh my gosh. I cannot describe the color of this though. Like, what is it? What is it? Is it like a burnt orange or a berry or... I don't know, I can't describe it. I guess it's more of a berry color, I don't know. But either way, it's really comfy. It's my size and 
I just think I will definitely wear this a lot this fall slash winter. So I got that. What else is in here? Okay, just two more things. I got this little black sparkly bat mask and this isn't for me to just wear. That's not why I bought it. I'm actually going to be using this as a background prop because I'm coming out with a new lip set lip balm collection soon and it's Halloween costume themed. So I thought how perfect would this be to just kind of put in the background of the photo. And lastly guys, I got some of these super fun Halloween erasers. There are spiders, spiderwebs, and bats in here. And the reason I got these was also for lip -sess orders. Since it is Halloween time, I like to give away some extra goodies with all orders. It's just more fun for my customers and it's more fun for me. So anyways guys, that was all for today's video. If you liked it, please don't forget to give it a big thumbs up. And I want you guys to leave a comment below and let me know. Oh, let me know what you're dressing up as for Halloween this year, okay? I really want to know, so make sure you tell me. I'm very curious. You can't leave me hanging, so fill me in on what your Halloween costume looks like this year. Also, if you aren't already subscribed, please make sure you click that red subscribe button. It would mean everything to me, but I love you guys so much. Thank you again for watching, and I will talk to you in my next video. Bye!